Hey guys, what's up? It's Dog here, and today I have a special surprise to show you. If I do this command, reset key, what do you think this means? Hmm. What about panel key? Hmm. Well, first, let me just show you. And let's go ahead and close this door. Here's a special little room I want to show you. Let me just disarm it real quick. And let's open up. This is my fire alarm collection. I'm not going to go into depth on each one, but I decided to now become a fire alarm enthusiast. I did not decide to do it in real life like S.E.R. safety because, well, I don't have the property to do it and I'd probably disturb the neighbors. So, I'm doing it virtually. I'm going to say this System Sensor L-Series, um, if you ever watch some of my videos, um, or the one from, uh, you may have noticed the fire alarm system, or you ever took the—you probably never even took the chance to notice. But we use System Sensor L series in our school, which is pretty cool. Last school I had an intermediate; they used these. I hated these because these are so loud. Fun fact: they actually never used this system yet. They never touched it. So we're not here for that. We are here for the demonstration. I have a little beep right there so that I know so it's coming. Let's go ahead and turn on lights so we can get it illuminated. Right here we have a Firelight BG6, Firelight BG12, and a Notifier T-Bar Pulse Station. And let's see, we have a System Sensor, Wheel Lock, two Wheel Locks, or three Wheel Locks, no, four Wheel Locks, one System Sensor, and one EST. We also have two um, Police ESTs right here, which are, will be in a future video, and they're, they look pretty cool. Now... Before we move on, this is going to be our New Year's Fire Alarm Celebration. And yeah, I have a T-Bar, and we also have some pretty cool alarms here. Some are quite rare. We have a Simplex. Two Simplexes right here that are pretty rare. Have a, let's see, we have this one, which is Honeywell, which is pretty cool. Never seen it before. We have a British Fire Alarm over somewhat of a Fire Alarm International. We have a System Sensor, pretty much, pretty common. Some other ones. Now this one is different. This one has um here let me go show you my collection. That one has a combination of let's see one of these and it has a simplex plate. This is the simplex plate which has the light and then that just has the horn attachment and we also have some other horns and simplex true alert. We also have some um Genesis I think, yeah, some Genesis. Alright. We also have a police pole station this time, which is pretty new. I have quite a few police pole stations. I have pretty much four of each pole station. I have the no I have the normal one and I have blue point. This one's also a Luxier edition. I'm looking on getting ones that are just um special collections, like push in and pull down. Or just pull down. We also have um notifier, these ones. We also have two types of game wheels, these ones, and then these ones come with a key switch. We also have some British fire alarms, but I cannot reset them, so we are not using them in the test. Alright, let's go ahead and head over to the testing room. Alright, we are going to, um, pull this... this panel. We're going to pull the BG6, then the BG12, then the notifier. And we can, if when we're done, we might even, I might even get, um, put that there. Well, let's get some ambient lighting going on. Alright. Here we go. Alright, 
was a pretty good test. Now I have this one pulled, we can actually pull another one, it will still activate the system. So let's go ahead and do this one. detector on this one's kind of small and because of that I, I will sometimes easily click the reset key so I try my best to be able to hit the silence instead of reset because we don't reset it takes a little bit to restart and it's not fun all right now let's pull the notifier Also, we have an audible silence, which means we can turn off the alarm and it will keep the strobes flashing. So now let's reset them. Go ahead and do that. Put that one, and then try to open that key. Now we can go ahead and change them. Now, because of this way they made this panel, I have to do this weird glitch to be able to do it. So we're going to go ahead and do the evacuation. And it's playing out of the system sensor. Attention, please. There has been a report of an emergency. Proceed calmly to the nearest no, exit. And we can even change it. Let's do a weather alert. May I have your attention, please? Conditions have developed that require all occupants to proceed immediately to the nearest take cover shelter. Let's reset the system. There we go. Alright. So that was the end of this test. I hope you enjoyed the video. Now, if you want to see my other videos, you can. I'm going to go ahead and we're going to head back to the inventory. And I want to show you a few new ones that will be in the next test. So you have a sneak peek on what it's going to be like. In the next test, we're going to use this white EST. And we're going to use this one. And we're also going to use this. We're going to use this collection, too, of Edward's Genesis. I don't know the exact type of this, so if anyone knows these kind of type of alarms, please send me in the comments, because that'd be great, because I'm still looking for more of these. And if you guys want to send me some of your fire alarms for Roblox that I could use in future tests, you can go ahead and send me the modeling. But it must be compatible with the Gamewell fire control instruments, and it must be with the EST-3, which is um, one of the EST integrity panels. And these are the two primary panels I use, so that's why I just needed it to, or that's why I asked that you use that. This panel will also be used in some other future tests, and um, comment if you want the blue police alarm, you want the Luxiar dual action pulse station, or the tap, or the tap to activate. So this is the blue one, this one, or this one. You gotta pick. I personally think, I have to say, the Luxiar double action pull stations are really cool, as well as these uh, Luxiar BG12. I do not have the LX versions. I'm looking on getting an addressable one. If you want to send me an addressable one on Roblox, you can. Anyways, that's all. So see you guys in the next test. Great Christmas.